Hello? Is this uh, Simpson Classics headquarters? Yeah, it is. Yeah, what's up? Oh, got a delivery for you. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I hear, I hear this is a place where cars can be worked on. Yeah, it might be. It's a bit empty in here. It is a bit empty. I think we need to change that. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. I knew James was coming. Got some biscuits. Oh, that's one in James. It's one. You've seen this car before, guys. She was featured many moons ago. She was. She was. She's looking a bit poorly, pal. <laughs> uh, well, in reality, she hasn't moved much since, um, since that video. No. Um, a lot of stuff in life has happened, but nothing, <laughs> nothing to this poor old girl. So, um, James, do you want to introduce Eve to the channel? Well, if you haven't seen the first video, it was quite a few years ago now, wasn't it? So Yeah, I think it's two, three years ago now, isn't it? Oh, I've had Eve since 2009. Learned to drive in her. It was my first car. Um, still got her 12 years later, 13 years later, got 22. For all your sins. Um, <laughs> I can't get rid of her, but actually it was probably the main reason why how me and Mark met yeah, was yeah. because... Um, Mark had a clubman at the time. I had a Cooper actually, didn't you? Yeah, so. <laughs> the Cooper that you, a lot of oil. Yeah, you probably gathered about quite a few minis over the years. So, um, is it North Sussex Miona's Club? It was North Sussex Miona's um, Club. Don't really do a lot anymore, but yeah, James and his dad stuff set that up and we had a couple of minis. Yeah, COVID and everything. Nothing yeah. we've had to meet for many years. Yeah. But, um, yeah, Mark came along with his Cooper, but he shortly after that he ended up with a clubman that had a little. Little minor accident. It had a bit of a bump, didn't it? Yeah. And um, I was like, yeah, we'll go around and have a look at it, let's see how bad it is. And then we just um, we didn't do anything, did we? So no, we ended up just chatting. <laughs> yeah, we just chatted for hours. So um, and, you know, Eve, what? Uh, Eve, ninety five, ninety four. Ninety five. Yeah, ninety five. Mini Mayfair, isn't it? Mini Mayfair. Yeah, it's missing the Mayfair decals. Are um, we gonna Are we gonna put them back on? I will. The, yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, um, all white, aren't we? All white. One. It's white diamond two, not one. Yeah. Um, one is actually slightly whiter. Yeah. Two is very premium, but if you if you can tell with the lighting in here, but um, it has been painted in white diamond one, and it has been painted in white diamond. Yeah. So there is so, you yeah. can't you can kind of actually see it really well actually in this light. So you got the scuttle on the wing are completely different colours. You can actually it picks up really well on yeah, this camera. Yeah. So when so. it was cleaned and polished, you could really tell the the main part of the car was creamier. Yeah. Um, but the rest of it was white. But it's had a bad front end replacement or like it was probably good at the time but yeah it's, it's so we'll just quickly check that out so the color coded duct tape is just amazing genuine, um the genuine wing genuine they've all been fillered haven't they you didn't do this or so under here has actually been fillered so you, there's no <laughs> there's no seam whatsoever yeah. um when it was replaced and this is the wing that's been done isn't it uh is yeah it? i think the original is the one on the right Mike, i mean it's that's got, patina people pay a lot of money for that James. yeah i know yeah, look at that little rust there you know but it's still solid so yeah well, well then i think there's a dent in it was well. that some rust that just fell on the floor don't know. yeah that, that was um what's <laughs> going on with that i think the uh the, the winds broke that i uh, broke that with a uh, <laughs> recent year <laughs> but so front end's got to come off bonnet stripes are going the bonnet Catches are going just because the bonnet rusted. So my the bonnet, yeah, the bonnet. The, basically, the bonnet is that rough that it yeah, actually needs it, them. It needs <laughs> them um, unfortunately, had oversills put on. Done in two thousand nine, um, but wasn't done very well. And I don't understand why you can still see the original white. Original yeah, you can actually see. It. So we obviously do a video, kind of going through this car, but um, this is the next project, guys. So we're gonna we're gonna start on Eve and get it done, yeah. but. Oversills, you know, 
well, how many projects James have hired on here now? Lots. <laughs> your dad's Lots. included, I yes. think. No, your dad had original series. No, no, we're original series. Yeah, your dad's 100, actually. 105, yeah. 110. But the 72 long. estate for Pete, mate, that was one oversill, one original yeah. sill. Um, the 89 are both oversills. Uh, what else? Had? My side all had oversills, four did the channel. Oh, I don't know how many uh, cards were oversills. It's, it's a, that that um, uh, MPI it was, Cooper's. It was a quick and easy repair back then, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was. It, and uh, without doing them, as I said to a lot of people, you wouldn't have these cards, cards still. Yeah. So yeah. it's basically an MOT repair. Yeah, so. it's, it's enabled me, and it's obviously, if you saw the 2019 London Brighton Mini Run, that was the last time. Uh, do you know, IMM 2019. Yeah, I was going to say, we did IMM because we've just scraped some mud off from underneath the car. Yeah, and if you ever remember <laughs> IMM 2019, that mud was acidic, so it's probably made it a lot worse. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> but yeah, so, coming to the back, it's had a bit of vandalism in the past that someone's tried to... Yeah, there's a, like, to an old ink on there. This is all just dirt. Um, um, really quite solid round here, James, which is obviously a good yeah, sign. Yeah, the good parts, yeah. the rear, apart from the boot, but the um, and the roof are The roof's really, really good, good, isn't it? Um, so, maybe because I this took, is this is actually took, painted on as well, isn't it? Yes. So, when I got the car, it was vinyl, wasn't it? When you got it? Uh, no, it wasn't. It was white. Was it? I thought um, it had vinyl on it. Before. But when I bought it, the owner said it was due to sun damage, but it was similar to this. It, yeah. It looks really faded, and it was really showing through. And I think someone had just sprayed a bit of paint over, then polished it smooth. Yeah. Right? It looked really bad. And at the time, I'll tell you, I put vinyl on it to cover that up. Yeah. Um, but then the vinyl went funny, and yeah. I, I sanded the vinyl off because the glue was just impossible to get off. And then I painted it. And to be fair, for a, it looks yeah, for, a, for a good few years, it looked really good, didn't it? Did it did for a few years. But it's just started to do what everything does. It some Cracks. damages and yeah. I prob I'm trying to think if I lacquered it in the. I think I did lacquer it in the end, which is probably why it's done not too bad. But it then has sat outside, and I did this in 20. 2011, 2012, so... <laughs> I know, the old CB radios. Yeah, nice the magnet. <laughs> imprint on there. So basically what we're saying here, James, is um, it's a full Mark, reference. Mark's not going to be friends with me after. <laughs> I'll always be friends with <laughs> So James is going to help with this build as much as he can. Obviously me and James live hundreds of miles apart, which is absolutely gutting. Um, but we are going to get this done between us. So obviously the metal work, the shell work, we're going to paint it back to its original colour. Yeah, the roof's so going. No right. stupid body modifications, just the shell back solid. Yeah, the, the only thing I want to keep, because I personally like and I think it was one of the first things I did when I got the car, is the wooden picket style arches. Oh yeah, so yeah, it's not got the original arches, does no. it? So, so we're but keeping I, them I, on I, it. I like, I'll get a new set, but I like Are we going to colour code them? Yes, we're going to colour code yeah, them. Yeah, I think yeah. that looked quite nice. It look, make um, it look a bit more modern, wouldn't and it? And I will probably stick with the four spike revolutions because it was... Yeah, she's yeah, always had them. She's always yeah. had them. I, I, we, we had, it came with mini lights, actually. Yeah, so, but ever since I've known you, it's always had yeah, these. Yeah, I was the first one of the... We actually bought this for my 1275 GT project when I was yeah. 16, and we bought the wheels for that, and we never used them. Um, no. So, oh, actually, oh, I might be wrong there, but it was. I've had these for a very long time. I probably won't get these refurbed because you can still buy them new, so... Yeah, yeah. Well, um, it might just need um, keying back and basically it's done what every wheel does. The lacquer yeah, pills can't slide on it, but you might, you can polish them and re-lacquer them and the sensors are fine. I might so. refurb them, but... Yeah, it might save you. you I think your panel wheel is going to be enough, change. Yeah, I know. Maybe, maybe that's something that will save. <laughs> But so yeah, essentially she's original. I believe the badge is the right badge as well, isn't it? It is, yeah. That's it the is. right Rover badge, yeah. so... Um, I will get the... Originally, I'm pretty sure it was a two-line pinstripe down the side. Yeah, I think it had... And then and the Mayfair fed off of it. Yeah, um, I think so. So we're going to try and put that so back some, on. So that's obviously come off at some point. Um, I've still got the original Mayfair and the 1.3, so... And they're in good nick still, actually. We actually replaced these in the Yeah, way. so that's what the uh, decal is, isn't it? It's yeah, that same so. kind of style, so it looks a little bit like that on the side. But, yeah. But, um, um, but yeah, no, she, 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 her time has come <laughs> many, many years later. Yeah, so we're going to just wander over here, James, and we'll just start cutting out now, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Get, 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 get the grinder out, yeah? No, we won't do it yet. I won't turn this thing on. <laughs> <laughs> Should we learn how to weld? <laughs> Might give it a go. <laughs> so, yeah, it, it's the first one in the barn, which is awesome. Um, should go and get one of my cars soon. But yeah, we're, uh, <laughs> we're um, it's the first one in. And, oh, well, Violet technically was. Violet was the first car. But, yeah, it's, uh, as James said, uh, exciting time for head free. It's a bit of a close to your heart car, isn't it? I yeah, guess I, the best I, thing I, to put it. So, I this I'm never going to get rid of it, so. We're going to get delving into it. Um, I think the first point of call is strip it. 
exterior-wise, leave it to the shelf for a bit. Done you a favour and took the interior out. Thanks, appreciate that. If you haven't seen that video, don't forget to do a video on that. And the steering wheel looked like you could eat it because it had like things growing off it, didn't it? And stuff yeah, like it's that. actually survived. It's survived, but that was, <laughs> um, that was a year ago. So uh, all the glass will have just come off. We're going to get some shelving put up to see the workshops that are work in progress and get it to a rolling shell so we can assess it and make a bit of a panel list. And then Mini Mine, you're going to get a phone call. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> so if you haven't checked out Mini Mine, um, the link description below, we are going to have some discount codes coming up again. Um, I think Joe's going to have to use them, discount code? Or, yes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> um, there's going to be lots of little things. Yeah, that so are we are basically, I'd say one of everything. I don't think it's that bad. It's going to be front end door skins, boot repairs, seals and stuff like that. So we're working with Heritage and M Machine and stuff like that. I think it was the best point of call. We'll do it right, might as well, aren't we? Yeah, like low cheap panels and might as well do it right. We'll do it. Um, it's um, we'll do it as, as what we believe is best, and yeah. we're not going to go full heritage, but it, it's, no, it's but a part that's going to be used. Exactly. So. Yeah, so it needs it needs to be um, right. So we're um, yeah. So obviously go check out Mini Mine. They, they do sponsor the channel, and obviously working with Frost as well. Obviously another sponsor the channel. We're going to need a lot of paints. Well, it's going to be exciting tools coming to this. Maybe some four fifteen. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's it's one of the and stuff. stuff. So there's a lot to come from both sponsors regarding this car as well, um, and obviously all the other projects moving on to that. So yeah, without further ado, should we go get another one? Should we go get another one? Let's go get another uh, car. So this is Eve, the Mini Mage Bear, guys. <laughs>